Hello Sagittarius, I'm Susie from The Gifted Road 2 and I'm here to read your card for the week of the 4th of, I want to say May. Maybe something's going to happen for you on the 4th of May. So it's the 4th of April, 4th to the 10th, next seven days for Sagittarius, angels, spirits, universe. What would you like Sagittarius to know? What would you like Sagittarius to know about the next seven days? What's the story for Sagittarius? What would you like Sagittarius to know? Angel Spirit Guides, what would you like Sagittarius to know about this week of this 4th to the 10th of April? Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarius. Yeah, because I, I've just seen, you, you've got the moon, so when I said the 4th of May, you have to wait the month of the moon before everything gets straight. A couple more for Sagittarius, please. More, please, Sagittarius. Okay, so on the bottom of the deck, we've got this Ace of Wands, phallic symbol, um, passionate, spark, but a spark that can very quickly go out if you don't grab it. Both hands. <laughs> um, a new business, a new spark, a new passion, something gifted to you, and it's on fire. You know, it's like, wow. Um, it could be just an idea, and it's like, follow it up, don't let it go. You've got the Knight of Swords coming in to tell you something. You could have had a brother to tell you something or a Gemini or someone who's got your back is coming in to say, you know, we, you, you're, you've mastered a craft, you're independent, you're travelling, uh, do you want to travel with me? Do you, they're, they're, they're seeing that you're very independent. Um, someone also wants to fly in and have some fun with you. This, but this is your card. Maybe in your head, I just want to go and have some fun. I want to go and see my friends. Um, but I've got to be here and abundant and stay where I am. Um, you, you might feel a little bit bored, but you're also very abundant. So there are offers coming into you because people are seeing you as independent and, and mastering everything and overseeing everything, being a mother, being a, a leader, um, and very pregnant with new ideas or pregnant as a mum, you know, so and you're very fertile this week, so be careful, if these people are flying in, this, there's a reason there, it's like I'm hearing a honeypot, you're like a honeypot, um, the moon is also motherly, this could be something about the mum, people coming in with information, this could be brothers and sisters talking about a mother figure, or people gossiping um, about what you own, or what your abundance is, uh, you're very confused and emotional because you don't have enough information. Things could be secrets, could be coming out, coming to the surface. Um, so this puts you in this sort of indecisive mode or someone's deciding to go off on a new quest. And you feel like it's time to complete something and go around and do something better because you're being offered, you're graduating, someone wants to complete, be complete with you um, you're feeling like a whole person, you can dance and say, I came so far, I've come too far, you know, this secret could have come out, now this has put me on the back foot, I need to complete something, maybe in love, so that I can go around again and do it differently this time, um, someone's not bringing something into fruition, or prom they're making a lot of promises, but they're not making anything actually real, this is a lot of options for you, a lot of doors are opening for you, and there'll be a lot of communication this week, and creative travel you could hear someone could tell you they're going traveling or they're coming towards you by airplane um they want to talk to you they want to be with you they said, might say what do you want and you say well i want to travel i want to go somewhere um but you don't you don't want to talk or there's this stalemate, maybe because this person's going away and you're, you're talking abroad or there's a distance between you. There's sort of this like decision that needs to be made so that everything is just and legal and fair at the end of this week. Yeah. 
you might choose to complete something and then one of these could be you want to travel with this person and go traveling with this person um, then make a choice after you've spoken all this there's lots of communication and swift arrows of love to uh, that you're going to legally bind something or or you'll get a tax rebate something is is justified and knowledgeable and truthful you need to decide what you want she's saying what do you want and she said well bring him back and she said well what 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 about this relationship are you going to bring into the realms of reality what can you manifest if you if you, you could all these options all these pie in the sky things that you could have with this person but how are you going to choose one and bring it down you might have to go away with this person You might have to fly out to this person or them to you. There might have to be a lot more communication. Um, but this communication could end up in a decision or a stalemate where two people stop talking and then it has to be done in the law or a marriage or a divorce. Or... but someone's flying in because it's, you're independent you've almost mastered something and this other person's it's your energy but you it's like I want to go and have some fun with my friends or I want to talk about something and it's because you're bored if you it's drink drugs and rock and roll this person's bored you're here harvesting your abundance and your creativity these people could be coming in to help you but you're still emotionally confused you're not sure which way to turn or what's true or what's not true with the, what these people are saying um, so it puts you in a state of should I go on another quest, should I travel should I join this team um, I need to end something so that I can choose what I want to do and then I can maybe communicate or go travelling with somebody someone might ask you to go abroad with them um, let's ask the romance angels what would you like Sagittarius to know what would you like Sagittarius to know Okay, so we've got playfulness and children. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Your love life is being affected by children. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a high level of commitment, but it might be codependent. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. And finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So, you know, it's saying to be childlike, playful. Um, that's that night of wands. It's your energy. You just want to have some fun. But um, there's people talking about you. Maybe your finances with that nine of wands, nine of coin. And you're not sure whether you want to deal with these people because you're quite happy being independent. Um Someone might ask you what you want or to come away with them or to start again, sort of go around on this cycle again. Well, there's a lot of fire, there's a lot of passion. There's a little bit of talking. But the only cups I see in here are... The seven of cups, it's like someone just doesn't know what they want. Or the four of cups, which is that boredom, it's like there's something in front of your face, but you're not looking at it. There's a secret to be revealed this week. Let's ask the angel spirit guides universe, what would you like? Someone, someone might be just a bit too childish for you because you're the empress or and you're independent. And these knights are not, not even a king. And you're sort of very fertile, very motherly. Angel spirit guides, what would you like? This might be an age gap. Angel spirit guides, what would you like Sagittarius to know about this week, the 4th of April? Sagittarius, please, what would you like Sagittarius to know? What would you like Sagittarius to know? 
Look at the Sagittarius to you. Look at the Sagittarius to you. We've got schooling and study. And education help your life's purpose and personal growth at this time. The angels will guide you and help you with this process. Healthy lifestyle. Eat a healthful diet, get adequate sleep and exercise regularly for optimal health. Angels, spirit guides. What would you like Sagittarius to know about this week of the fourth? This week of the fourth. You have a gift for working with young people and your divine purpose involves helping, teaching or parenting children. So you might have to look after the kids this week. That's why the kids are affecting your romantic life. There's a dependency. Um, hello from heaven. Your loved ones in heaven are doing fine. Let go of worries and feel the loving blessings. So the angels or people from the other side are helping you get healthy. Um, there could be something to do with, with children and help and schooling and having to school them and educate them. Or you could be a teacher or a mum just helping the kids. And then someone says, come away with me. And you can't because you could be dealing with a Libra. Angel spirit guide. What would you like? What the person most on Sagittarius's mind like to say to them? What the person most on Sagittarius's mind like to say to them? What would the person most on Sagittarius's mind like to say? That's too many. You can't give me all those. Give me like that's too okay. I regret lying to you. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. I'm starting to understand our connection. Someone could be like deciding to choose you and offer you. They want to talk to you a lot. Offer you abroad or they're coming to see you. Angels. And they want to apologise and tell you the truth and make things legal. Angels, spirit guides, universe. What would you like Sagittarius to know? What's Sagittarius to know? I lost myself for a little while. This person, what would they like Sagittarius to know? And I replay our conversations over and over. Someone's starting to miss you, understand what the connection is. Um, they want to talk to you. Um, they might not have good finance because uh, they're younger. Um, but there might be an engagement. Be playful. Don't be too cross sword stalemate. Like, like I said, there's something passionate here at the be new beginning. And um, don't put, blow the candle out, if you know what I mean, before it's even got the chance to catch fire. Um, you need to decide exactly what you want and communicate. It could be travel by air. Yes. Uh, take care, Sagittarius. Hope I've helped you. Please like, share and subscribe and I will speak to you soon. Bye-bye.